Over 200 ships have sunk in the Bay of Biscay and right now we are sailing through it. Now why does this happen? Let me give you a geographical example. This is the Bay of Biscay which we are sailing on at the moment. This is the North Atlantic which is deep which is 4500 meters and this is the continental shelf which suddenly gets shallow 30-40 meters. Let me go on the Ectis and show you exactly the depths. So if you see the Ectis here, you'll see 4800 meter depths in North Atlantic and when you move over here, suddenly the depths drop to 980 and when you come even more closer here, you'll see the depths go to around 20 to 30 meters. You see 25-30 meters. Now imagine the waves that have built up for thousands of miles in the Atlantic go and suddenly crash into the continental shelf which is steep and shallow. What will happen? The waves rebound back with a tremendous force and then it causes more swell of like we were talking about 15 to 20 meters. And you can see countless wrecks over here. These things are wrecks and it shows that nature always has the final say. Especially here in winters, the weather is so severe that the ships have to divert and not enter the bay for a long period of time to avoid this smashing and rolling, pitching, tossing. For example, right now you can see the vessel getting pitched and tossed with just a 6 meter swell coming from our port beam. So this is the Bay of Biscay, beautiful, brutal and never to be underestimated.